Now I've got the skills to pay the bills. Good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. Basically done making uh, all of the water catchers that I wanted to make. But we could uh, go out and have a little more funsies today. Thinking about uh, heading back to the main base and checking on the gas can situation. I did pick up a couple more gas cans. So I think I should probably fill those up. And uh, yeah, I do have one sitting in my bag. Doesn't do no good um, if the power goes out these empty gas cans. I do have a full gas can as well. Um, <clears throat> I want to practice making campfires and shit like that because I was giving that some thought and um, once the power goes out I won't be able to make fires and or cook in the ovens anymore I think. Unless they run on propane. Propane and propane accessories. Let me tell you, boy ain't right. <laughs> Anyways, it's pretty early in the morning. I've got my master carpentry book so I want to uh, Give that a read before I start building any, uh, accessory shit on my house. But I do want to make, a, a little fence for the garden. I think that would be quite a, quite a nice thing. And it seems that, uh, I can wear my sweater all day long without getting hot. Because the seasons, they are a-changing. Mm-hmm. There's a worm there. I could use it for, uh, bait or something like that. But I picked up a bunch of fishing tackles. So hopefully I'll... I'll be able to learn a little something there. Fill up my fuels. And one more. And we'll see where they, we can fit these. Um, one could probably go in there. Got room in this one? Yep. We could do two more in there, perhaps. Or I might have to carry one. Either way, I won't get the uh, threatened back injury. So that's good. Quite good, yes. All right. So we'll run it on in. My movement speed is a little bit reduced, but I ain't worried about that none too much. And uh, perhaps we could pick up a shotgun as well and clear out some of those houses, especially the one with the alarm that went off. I don't know why, it's just uh, set in my mind that that is something that I should do. Maybe it's a stupid idea, I don't know, probably it is. <laughs> but I, I, can't, I can't let it go. It's just been in my brain this whole time. Is that a shotgun over there, laying on the floor? It's uh, quite a few guns laying on the floor over there. I don't think the durability of the guns goes down, which is probably a good thing. Sounds like the refrigerators are still going and the lights are still on. So, no complaints from Mr. Dayton this morning. Everything seems to be going according to plan. And uh, here you go, floor. A little more, little more junk for you. Um... We could put away some of this stuff, I suppose. Juicer, marinara, jar with lid. Ah, uh, there's just no organization to this shit. I probably should have worried about that a little bit more. <laughs> but oh well, it be what it be. And there we go, some thread, some twine. Hmm. Whiskey bottle. I, I kind of want to make a uh, Molotov cocktail with that. But I'm not exactly sure how to do it either. So we'll put some whiskey and some sugar so I can lose those in my fucking giant pile of crap. And uh, I'll put the bibble away. Bibble can go there. Got glue and duct tape. Oh my goodness. All these things I picked up. I just couldn't leave it. Couldn't just leave it, could you, Dayton? No, sir. Not me. All right. Still got those uh, couple of cups of coffee, which are probably disgusting and stale by now, but <laughs> it's okay. That's just fine. I'm going to leave the uh, the stuff that I'll probably need right here. Expert cooking? Mm-hmm. Master farming. I'll probably need them at some point, but that point is not today, I don't think. Hmm. Should go hunting some nails, probably. Oh, there's a fucking gas can in my inventory. I should make sure to drop that off as well. I don't need all this extra weight. I'm carrying all this extra weight. I should have gone on a diet. There we go. It's a horrible, uh, horrible accent that I've got going there. I'll read a little bit more of the expert carpentry book. Because why not? Seems like a smart thing. 
but it is just so long. 340 pages compared to 200 and something before. But uh, even reading just a little bit of it is going to boost my, uh, my carpentry skill if I start doing some carpentering. So there we go. We'll read 50 pages of it. I'll save this for later. Probably won't remember it at all, but <laughs> that's just how it goes sometimes. Alright. It was nice to see you, base. Hmm. Should I get the shotgun? I don't think I have that much room for a shotgun in my inventory. Uh, I do. It's not too bad. Here. Can opener, you can go there. I'm uh, not hesitating to just throw stuff on the ground, largely because uh, it's easy to spot when it's laying on the ground. The Remington, those take Springfield. Yeah, this is what I want. It's got a rifle sling and a half choke on it. We need to find some double out shells so we can use it. Semi-auto shotgun. Semi-auto shotgun. There we go. 25 shell box, and we got three of them. I should grab two of these. Mm-hmm. That'll do nicely. And, uh, that doesn't weigh me down too much. I'm gonna get some aiming practice up today. Tell you what. Clear that fucking house out. If I can even find it again. <laughs> I have my doubts that I'll even be able to spot it. But, uh, it be what it be. That's for sure. Good job, little man. Let's see if I can shove some of these things in bag and possibly get under the weight. There we go. Hmm. Yeah, 4.25 is quite a bit of weight. But that's okay. We're going to empty out those uh those rifle shells pretty quick, I'm I'm sure. And 50 shells should be able to kill some shit. Just a little bit of shit. Just a little bitty shit. A little baby shit. Actually, baby shit is not that little. Have you ever seen a baby shit? Babies make like a man-sized shit. That, that shit is just amazing. <laughs> that shit is just amazing. Yeah. It certainly is. Alright, so I think I've checked uh, all of these houses on this side of the street. I could check the other side, but I'm not really, uh, not really into that. Maybe I could, uh, clear out a couple of those zombie heavy houses with the shotgun. Just kind of start shooting outside, but if you start shooting, like, a lot of zombies come, so it's not really going to clear it out <laughs> in the way that I'm hoping that it will. I think they'll just, uh, start swarming, because there are a fucking lot of zombies in the neighborhood. That is for suredly. Hmm. Hmm. Where's the zombie house? I can't recall. Where I left all my zombie friends. Yeah, bitch! She got knocked back. Knocked back! Let's go ahead and take some antidepressants. And that was the last uh, little bit in the bottle. Do we get an empty pill bottle? I guess not. I have seen empty pill bottles in the game, so it surprises me that uh, I wasn't left a little pill bottle from that. But it's okay. Everything's okay here. There's the for sale sign. Yeah, I think this is uh, near the house that got all fucking zombified with the alarm and whatnot. Hmm, there's a broken window over there, but I don't know if that is the house. I think it was a little up from the one with the for sale sign. Better finish this bitch before that guy comes over. Hey, buddy. There were some seeds on that lady. I might want to pick those up. Because they are mystery seeds, but mystery seeds are edible. Hmm. Yeah, there are quite a few zombies over here. Making me, uh, just a mite nervous. Oh, this is definitely the house. Has all of the windows broken out. It's either this one or the one next to it. Yep. This is, uh, not a good place to be, I think. Dead, dead, dead. Get away, get away! Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Everybody down. There you go! Did I kill that one? Oh, it was the other. That'll do. Come on, lay down! Fucking lay down! She was resistant! Alright. So the options are, uh... 
pull out the shotgun and hopefully I don't lure more zombies than I can handle. Or go in the fucking death house with uh, just a baseball bat equipped. And I think what I want to do is clear out some of the zombies outside and then uh, use the shotgun to lure the zombies from inside to the outside. And hopefully uh, I won't end up with a whole bunch of them, although probably, probably I will. <laughs> That's just the way things seem to go. So, okay, let's uh, equip this. Oh my god. Get somewhere safe where I can equip this. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. How you feeling today? My god. They're just everywhere. No, no creepy zombie music. There we go. Twofer! What to tell you about Double Mint Twins? I guess I got them both. That'll do just fine. And how about you, fella? Get down! Hmm, cologne. He thought he was getting some. Nope. Only Dayton does. Can't you see? Can't you see? Alright, so, uh, shotgun time. Let's see how this shit goes. Oh, but I need the fucking... The shells out of the doctor's bag. Damn it. Here we go. We'll shove them in this bag. That should do nicely. Keep your head on the swivel. Can't let them sneak up on you. Hmm. Making me a little bit nervous. Already, I haven't even fired the, the shotgun once. And I'm nervous. Okay, okay. I don't have uh, anything to beat these zombies away with currently, so let's unbox all these fucking things. We'll load up the shotgun. We'll see how it goes. Fingers fucking crossed. Uh, unbox all these. Come on. You can do it. They're coming after me. There we go. Now reload. Hooray! Reload and... Need to reload a little more. That's not all the way full, is it? Hmm. And I am a little, uh, a little peckish. That's troubling. All right. Now if I could line all these zombies up. Hey, fella. Y'all want to get in a, a nice cone formation for me? That would be nice. That'll do. I think she's still alive. Just grazed her. All right. Keep the uh, keep the ammo reloaded. Gotta stay stocked. Oh my god. Hello, hello. Lovely to see you all out here today. A wonderful day in the neighborhood. A wonderful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? That'll do. Jesus. This is uh, a little bit of a stupid idea. Strong panic. Accuracy severely reduced. Yeah. I think so. I'm uh, panicking just a little bit. But they're slow. They're fucking slow, so we don't have too much to worry about. I hope. And I think they're, uh, this is clearing them out of the house, maybe? It seems possible. Okay. Panic is dropping down. Just a little. There we go. Run them this way. Okay, okay, okay. How's this? Yeah! Come on, you motherfuckers! Jesus. Panic, panic, very panic! Alright. We'll just keep swooping them. Swooping them and looping them. Really, when they're out in in the uh, in the big wide world, they're not they're not so terrifying. All right, you just got to be careful when they uh, they get you in a house or some shit like that. That's what is probably the worst situation. Okay, hello everyone. Could you come this way for me? Smile for the camera. Need to wait for my accuracy to drop a little bit. Here, we got some beta blockers, don't we? Take some pills. Take some peels. 
Peels here. Peels, peels, peels. Yeah. Thinning the herd. All right. Anybody else? Anybody else fucking want some? Yes. The, the answer is yes. Quite a few of them want some. All right. I, I hate to use it on just one chick. I want to get them all lined up. Oh my god! That's a crawler. Jesus Christ. He tricked me. I thought he was going to get me. There we go. That's nice. And it seems like uh, the horde is thinning just a little bit. We just might be okay. Although that fucking crawler's making me just a little nervous. Just a little nervous. Okay. Can we get him? No. He's below the blast of the shotgun. Oh my god, there's another crawler. What in the fuck? Okay. Crawlers make me more nervous than anything. They are the fucking hardest ones to take out, for sure. Because you gotta get really close to hit him with the bat. So, uh, let's, let's swoop over here. We'll dip by the crawlers. There you go. Everybody alright? You wanna come over here with Mr. Dayton? Come on. Why don't you come along? Why don't you come along on a ride with me? Hmm. It's not looking so hot. Maybe I could just, uh... Hey, bitch! Hey, bitch! There we go. Maybe I could get three. Three and one? How's that? Yeah! I did it! I did it, you sucker motherfucker! Alright. Nice, uh, con conservation of ammo, I do think. And once we get, uh, our third point completed in firearms, we it'll be safe to, like, use pistols and shit like that. Shotguns are the best thing to use early on in your firearm skill, I'm coming to find out. And then presumably rifles are the last thing that you want to do. Should I shoot this fuck through the window? What are you doing? It didn't even break the window. <laughs> it's uh, a bad idea. Don't do that because it's a bad idea. How about you? How about you? Yeah! Anybody else? Any of these other stupid fucks? Alright! Now we're doing it! Big League! Very nice. So now there's just a, a couple of crawlers. Oh, I really don't want to fuck with those guys. And I used uh, about a box of shells. Which ain't too bad. Let's see. And now I'm fucking hot. Wonderful! Here, equip this secondary. We'll keep an eye out for the crawlers, although I think they uh, can't move so fast. Oh, look at them. They're so stupid. All right. Put that away. Give it another spin. Make sure we're not getting fucked from some direction. All right. Not bad, not bad. Now, if I could uh, eliminate these guys, I would be pretty golden. But I really do not like. I think circling around the side is the best, uh, the best option. And then you hit him from the back. Jesus Christ. Okay, alright. Dead. Oh, alright. That was quite uh, an adventure. And I still hear some fucking banging around in the house. Criminy. There's two of them. Alright. Now you're free. Don't turn on me. I freed you. There we go. Dead and dead. And now I'm uh, really starting to starve, so let's uh, pop in here. I think this was the burglar alarm house, or maybe it was the, the next one over. Either way, cleared it out just a little bit. I'm going to eat a delicious banana for lunch. I like that the banana. Oh, rotten Chinese cabbage. Oh, no. That's bad. 
And then a delicious donut. Donut for me. In here? Anybody? Okay. I think this house is uh, relatively cleared out. I don't say that with conviction, though. <laughs> Some of them just uh, are quiet. They stand there and fucking wait for you. Anybody in here? Hello? All right, the window is broken, so I'm not sure what to make of that. Here, we'll lock ourselves in the broom cupboard. Wonderful idea. Here's some nails. I could use some nails. More crates, mm-hmm. Easy to transport, plank style. Uh, a little bit of glue. I'll sniff that later. Ugh, ugh. Glue's coming back in a big way. Hmm. I guess I could check the kitchen cabinets, but I would like to go upstairs. Who knows how many zombies came upstairs? Probably not many. If there were some, they'd be in the main hall, I believe. But I'm not sure about that either. Ooh, comic book. I like a comic book. Scissors. Hmm. Scissors not good for killing zombie. All right. Box of water purification tablets. Where, where, where? Nothing, nothing, nothing. All right. I always hope that I'll find some uh, purification tablets when I head into bathrooms and stuff like that, but they never seem to be there. I think I've got to go to uh, a big place. And I'm not going to say the mall because, yeah, that would be a, a suicide mission at this point, I think. I will grab this bat. An extra one, because uh, we're doing some dangerous things today. Zombie elimination mission, Oh yeah. But I think that worked pretty well. We cleared that house out, although I think the, uh, the dangerous house is the next one over. That's okay. One step at a time. Step by step, day by day. Grab some garbage bags and we'll make them go away. Make a big thing. I don't know how the song goes. Oh, shit. That's a good reaction, though, Dayton. You hear breaking? Get the fucking... Get the bat up. Prepare for the worst. Alright. This seems to be the death house. So, let's see. Hello, friend. Lovely to see you here. Lay down. And I guess, uh, the shotgun blast lured all the zombies out of the house. The burglar alarm lured all of the zombies in the area, I suppose. So the shotgun blast couldn't be louder than the burglar alarm or something like that. Um, let's not start looking for things until we clear the house out. That seems smart. Alright. Hello, hello. Greetings to you. There we go. Mm-hmm. I think this was uh, the first place I was checking. Yeah, there's some nails in there. Ugh, oh, fuck. The stress of this game does not do my heart any favors. My heart's just gonna fucking explode. A little more nails. Mmm, I like it. Super glue. I don't know what you do with that. That's not for repairing anything that I know of. I will right, take this MRE. We'll make it a little later. We'll open up the little heating pack and uh, have a nice snacky snack. Yeah, we're doing some pretty good rhyming today, too. That's what happens when your heart starts going. You start rhyming. Expert electrical. Hmm. Masonry. Oh. I guess I should read some masonry shit. Yes, this will work just fine. Pottery textbook I've already read. Soap making. Oh. We should learn how to make some tallow. From the, uh, the many corpses that are laying around. I know how to skin them. I can make human skin. Do I have expert cooking? I think I had master cooking. Hmm, I can't recall. It's not like I'm gonna remember one way or the other. Anybody in here? Nobody? That's just great. Okay. 
Jesus. Well, managed to clear this place out with uh, only 20-something shells. I guess it was almost 30. But still, not too bad. Not too shabby. Hmm, box of tissues. Come on, I just want some water purification. Straight razor? I don't know what you do with that. I tried shaving with the straight razor one time. It made me so fucking nervous. I could not do it. I don't know how people do it. Hmm, box of clothespins. Nope, nope. Tampons. Nope, nope. Pumice stone. Oh, yeah. That's good. I'm gonna sit here and scrub my feet. Because I've been running for so long, and they are so calloused, don't you see? Maybe I should dig through this giant pile of bodies. Let the bodies hit the floor! The floor! Alright, you got some mystery seeds on ya. Magazine, couple worms, credit card. I don't give a shit about any of that. Why does that person have two glasses? That don't make no sense. And another uh, Remington. I have one. Laying on the floor. Of my main base. Bleh. Get down! Just another body in the pile. How's that? You're just a body. You're just a body to me. Should we remove the bush? Yeah, let's remove a bush. Oh, isn't that so fun? Did I get something from the bush? Guess not. That's a shame. All it does is make the bush go away. I thought I'd get some, like, berries or some shit. <clears throat> but even if you forage up some berries, um... There's one... One berry out of the four types on the server is randomly generated to be poisonous. And only herbalists can tell the difference. But, uh... I made a stupid job choice. <laughs> I'm an electrician, not an herbalist. Down. I'm just gonna murder everybody. That's what we're doing today. Endless murder. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, what do you say? Why do we kill some zombies today? Yay! One more? One more. Ah, it does my heart good. Especially now that we're out in the real world and not fucking locked in with a bunch of zombies. Oh, my reloading skill is, is ready to be uh, boosted too. As is my sprinting. As is like everything. But I need to find a way to uh, to make some more experience points. I guess we could uh, do the carpentry thing. That's always good for the experience. But I need to finish reading my book. I barely even dented my book. Can you climb over that fence? He sure can. What a smart boy he is. Oh shit, don't bite me. Please no. Alright. Wonderfully done. Let me eat your energy bar, son. Ah. And we've got 18 XP until I can level up that sprinting one more again. It's, uh, it comes slowly. It comes so fucking slowly these days. I used to have skill points falling out of my ass. More skill points than I could possibly use. But that is simply not the case anymore. Ah. Uh, so that house that I, uh, couldn't stop thinking about because it had an alarm had almost nothing of worth inside of it. So next time there's an alarm house, I'm just gonna leave it. <laughs> Although it was good for leveling the uh, the skills and whatnot. Now I've got the skills to pay the bills. That's right. Ben. Dead. Hmm. I assume I checked this house because it's down the street from the other house. Or maybe I didn't, because there's a bunch of nails in here. Hmm, ah. Even if I checked it before, I don't count on myself to uh, have a good enough eye for everything. Empty notebook. Hmm. Yes. I could read it. Wouldn't that be wonderful? 
Some more thread. Mm, I got so much thread, I don't know what to do with it anymore. I can make a fucking sweater. Okay. Where are they? Why? Why do I hear zombie sound and there's no zombie? What the fuck? I don't like it! I don't trust it! Please leave me alone! Alright, little exertion. That's fine, buddy. We're doing okay, aren't we? Five experience until next skill point. Ah, You're killing me, Smalls. And I've got, uh, four skills that are ready to be leveled. Damn. I could just go do a little fishing. Hmm, that's not a bad idea, actually. Little bit of fishing will get me there. And, uh, yeah, I don't have enough to get to the, the next level of fishing. Fishing level three. Because I know that sprinting is going to be the next skill point that I use. Hey, there it is. Alright, so this is my, my sprinting speed currently. And then you add a point to it. Boom. And am I faster now? I think just just a little tiny bit. It should work on like your cardiovascular shit too. Should be able to go longer without being as exerted. That would be a rather good idea. Jesus, man. No matter how many times you clear a place out, there's just more and more. Die. Thank you. Jesus. They're everywhere. Bodies, bodies, bodies. Mystery seeds. Mmm. I take these. And I need a little drinky drink. So pardon me. Oh my god. Please don't bite me. Yes. Die. You go to hell and you die. Hmm. And another wanderer. Where are you going? Where are you going? Hell? Mmm. Let me help you. Ugh. Yeah! <laughs> That's always nice. Oh my god, it's almost 8 o'clock already. It's almost past my bedtime! The street lights is gonna come back on! Hmm, is it a thousand experience for each skill point? I need to take a note of that. I think that it is. That would be a nice round number. But uh, perhaps it started out lower. And it's been getting higher and higher without my knowing. My god. The neighborhood's just gone to hell! Let me tell ya! I will cut over here by the pharma hug. And I'm going back to my regular ass base tonight. I've had enough of sleeping in the woods. Okay? That's it. It's over. Mmm, let's put the sweater back on. It's probably a little nipply out, hmm? My nips are hard enough to cut diamonds, hmm? I don't know if that's true. Probably. Probably! Unless the guy has, like, weird-shaped nipples. <laughs> are your nipples not pointy, like mine? <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about. Oh, Expert Cooking was the book that we had here, not Master Cooking. So it's good that I didn't pick that other cooking book up. Because it would just, uh, go to waste. I'd end up ripping the pages out and strewing them down the street. Wouldn't that be wonderful? Um, can I have a drink now? Drink this. Nope. Nope. Drink. Ah, oh, this fucking bug. Okay. There we go. Isn't that so much better? Now I can fucking get my drink. Jesus Christ! I don't know why that keeps happening. Is there a problem with my, with my keyboard? I've never experienced that for any other game. So, uh, a little bit weird. Definitely a little bit weird. But we'll, we'll live with it. It's fine. Anyways, it's about my Betty by time. So I guess I just, uh, restarted Zomboid so I can do a fucking outro. But it must be done. People will, uh, point it out if I don't do it. So anyways, friends, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. And please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. And if you do, friends, I'll send you a salt shaker. It's shaped like a chicken. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. And until then, buh bye one, two, three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again.
Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends. <laughs>